Kings and Queens, Jits, Kids, and Teens. I am back with that is full ass sky. And today we have Drake, Lil Yachty, and Mag Thee Stallion in the office. Now let's get straight to it. Mag posted on Twitter. I know I'm very popular, but y'all gotta stop attaching weak conspiracy theories and bars to my name. Nor will ever address me or at me with a fact or receipt. I am clout. Keep sucking my pussy. She then goes on to say, stop using my shooting for clout. Since when is it cool to joke about women getting shot? You especially rap. Are lame. This is the message Mad sent Drake after listening to his new project and hearing the song she felt was if he was dissing her on. Now, as most of you may know, Drake has writers, people who write his music for him. And Lil Yachty happens to be one of those writers on this specific song. And he lets it be known that he was not dissing Meg the Stallion. He was just talking about women lying about getting shots. I'm going to clear this line up because I know Drake is not going to do it. That's nothing to do it. Megan. About women lying about their butt being real when it's not, and like stallion as in like um like a like she's still like a she's still like fine like you know like a stallion, you know, that was it. Oh, I don't know if it broke up. What I said, I was just addressing the about getting shots, but she's still a stallion. That's all. Uh, like about getting shots, like like a lot about her butt being real, like her like um. Like, 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 butt shots. Lie about getting shots. In the song, Drake said, This bitch lie about getting shots. With an S at the end. But she's still a stallion. And some even believe that they were talking about this influencer. A tall woman who's been known for lying about getting butt shots. But Meg wasn't done. She then said, And when the motherfucking facts come out, remember all y'all's favorite rappers that stood behind a nigga that shot a female. People attack me, y'all go up for it. I defend myself, now I'm doing too much. Every time it never ends. And this did not happen until I came out and said I got shot. Y'all don't with me okay cool get by meg boyfriend party chimed in who also do a lot of writing for industry rappers and he said i been knew i had one a bad one to make a nigga mad one. so here's the question do you all believe that this was a mad the stallion this a coincidence or a metaphor y'all let me know in my comment section below